get out, get under the moon. Hey everybody, it's another Mario Monday here for Call of the Nerd. So I figured we'd play a game that I didn't really play a lot of when it first came out. Uh, Super Mario Galaxy, as you can see. Uh, there was a... I don't really remember why, but the, I think I was playing a lot of Pokemon on the... Maybe the Game Boy Advance? Even the 3DS? Or the DS at that point? I don't remember. But I think I was playing more Pokemon. Uh, got this game. Didn't play it really at all. I played like a little bit and I think I unlocked like two worlds in it. Uh, but I just totally didn't finish it. But my friend, uh, Matt, who if you remember our very first video, he is Drunkford in that one. Uh, he played the hell out of this one. He got all the stars and played everything. And after everything was said and done, he realized that he sunk so many hours in it and was like, oh, my life. So I figured why not for Mario Mondays, I bring this back out and actually play it <laughs> some more and hopefully finish it. We'll see. So we want to kind of, with these Mario Mondays, oh, so here's a funny story. I had this save file here because I tried to do this video already and my... Uh, after like 30 minutes of gameplay and I st uh, stopped record on the Elgato, apparently the Elgato decided, even though it was saying record, to not record any of the video. So I was very upset, to say the least. So we'll go with save file 2, <laughs> if you don't mind. Uh, create a game file on this planet. Do -do -do, do -do -do -do. Now I went with Mario for the last one because it's Mario Mondays, but just to differentiate, speaking in tongues, uh, just to differentiate which files I have, I'm gonna go with Peach. I'm gonna go with Peach. She's Peachy. Do you want to use this icon? Yeah. And I play a lot of Peach anyway when I play Super Smash Brothers, so I figured why not? Let's play Peach. Play this file, and hopefully Elgato will record this time, or I'm gonna break this room. Every hundred years, a comet appears in the skies above the Mushroom Kingdom. The comet was so large one year, it filled the skies and sent countless shooting stars raining down. The toads brought the shooting stars to the castle, where they became a great power star. It should have been a very happy time for the citizens of the Mushroom Kingdom, that was the night of the Star Festival, held once every hundred years to celebrate the comet. Dear Mario, I'll be waiting for you at the castle on the night of the Star Festival. There's something I'd like to give you. My cherry. My black cherry. <laughs> and that's why he's like, yay! So, I think that the Mushroom Kingdom's in a kind of similar situation like Hyrule uh, in Zelda, where there's just a constant state of reincarnation. Now, the reason why I say that is because this area is so different compared to all the other Mario games, especially Super, um, Super Mario 64. Uh, let's talk to the people. The little people. Oh, Rosh here! Oh, the guests are here! Time to party! Pull out the drugs! Talk. Mario. <clears throat> Mario! You're the last guest to arrive! Glad you can make it! Damn right I'm making it. <clears throat> Damn right I'm making it! What are you going to say to me? The Star Festival! The Star Festival starting out! How about I jump on you and you give me that? Give me that star! Fine. Uh, what do you guys say? To pick a star bit, you point your penis and move over with your... your... your anus. To pick a star bit, point your penis and move over them with your anus. Got it. Thank you, Toad. I'm glad you know so much about collecting star bits. Uh, you gotta say... The view from here is just the best. La, la, la. And these... These guys and gals. See, obviously this is before Toadette. 
because everyone is here without pigtails. So does that mean that Toadette is just unique and decided to have some fashion sense? Or, uh, and so these are all just men and, like, male and female toads, toadstools? Or this is just, like, kind of a smurf situation, and there are no girls until Toadette. And here comes again! Pew pew pew! Pew 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 pew! I should wait until they actually fire shit. Come on. Blow things up. Blow things up. Me like you bouncy. Me like you bouncy. Yeah, you're a big girl now. Oh no! Oh, oh everyone dying! Oh, the spaghetti! See, why doesn't Bowser always have these airships? He obviously has the means to create them. So he can just totally come in, blow everything in Kingdom Come, and then take over the rubble. Like he is now. Do, do, do. Oh no, I'm holding this big glob of jizz real tight to my bosom. I hope nothing happens to the castle. And she's just staring down this ship right there, and he can just totally blow her up. But no. Please, please. You are fully invited to watch me as I get into a party dress and turn into Bowsette. Oh no, I can't watch. <laughs> Here comes my bra! Obviously, this is before Bowsette was the thing. And here comes the aliens. <laughs> so I was commenting in the video that won't happen. Oh no! That, oh, so this is like cowboys and aliens. Just, we're gonna have aliens now, out of nowhere. Hurry to the princess, bitch, I'll do what I want. Uh, I guess I can cover that. Wee, wee, wee. The princess is this way. No, duh. Help me. I'm being assaulted. It's so hard to hold on to the jizz glob in my hands. No, you're waving your hands. Where's the jizz glob? Did you let him go already? I guess so. Why do the aliens look like they have boobs? Are these boob aliens? Filled with boob goblins? It's like that one episode of Green Green. It's like that one episode of South Park, uh, Heavy Metal, where they did the parody of that weird-ass movie called Heavy, Heavy Metal. And just everything involved big rock and boobs. There's the, there's the cheese glob again. And how structurally sound is it to actually take an entire castle with the ground? Granted, the ground actually stays together even though it's a clump of dirt taking it all up into outer space. Why doesn't Map Pack on Game Theorist make a game theory on this? The logistics actually picking up a castle into outer space. It's done Thousand Five Nights in Freddy's, might as well do this one. And up it goes! I really don't remember where the aliens come into play here again. But is it kind of like the outer space fiasco they had when they did uh, Mar Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door? I think it was that one. Really. And come back. Oh my! <laughs> so long! Enjoy your flight! <laughs> oh, skip through it all the doodle, your penis is a doodle! I had to. I can't have to. Oh no! I go flying now. Mama's lasagna. Uh -huh, bye, nerd. Mario. And this is Castle Supernovas. So exciting. Wake up. Wake up, sleepyhead. Look, I was touching your face. Tee hee hee. We're on a weird little planet with stone hedges on it. And I'm a bunny. 
Finally, you're awake. Let's play. So you just passed out because you crash landed this planet. But I kind of want to play now. Yeah, give me these. Thank you. And thank you. Thank you. Oh, fit. I want that one. Thank you. Jump with A. Wee. Come on, jump with A. Bitch, I'll jump when I want to jump. Let's play hide and seek. If you catch all of us, we'll tell you about where you are. Alright, so because I just played this, I kind of remember where everyone's at. Uh, yeah, I'll get you in a second, buddy. I don't want these star pieces before I even want you. Oh, that was actually quicker than the last time. He caught me! Tee hee hee. Oh. <laughs> Great camera panning. Oh, I knew I should have hidden the crater. Alright. We got any more star pieces here? Alright, I know there's one in here. Come here, bunny. I think you're so funny, huh? I think you're so funny. I think you're so funny. How about you tire yourself out now? Come on, come on. Come on. There we go, slow down. There we go, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Oh my gosh. There we go. You caught me! Oh, I knew I should have hidden in the crater. Yeah, I know you're all selling out your buddy. I guess I'll go in the crater. Oh, I guess that wasn't that crater. Are you a crater? No. Uh, I think you're a crater. Yep, you're a crater. Oh, shit. I wanna go this way. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Come on. Just give yourself up. Gosh, why is this so far from part so annoying? At least eventually they tire him out. There we go. You can't believe I let myself get cut. Look, I'm a jizz! Why do you call all of us? Maybe you really can help Mama. Mama! Haha, ha, jokes on you. This is not monetized. <laughs> Mama, do we get more star pieces? Uh, oh, I want some coins. Come on, oh my gosh. Playing in the 3D kind of aspect really is weird. Knock, knock. Who lives here? Do the bunny rabbits live here? The star bunnies? Aha! Uh -huh. I didn't I go- oh shit. I didn't go your way. I go to my own- beat my own drum off. <laughs> Get ready for this. I've been watching you from here. This place is called the gateway to the starry sky. This is gonna screw my voice up so badly. My name is Rosalina. I watch over and protect the cosmos. They save you special one with your special home. You'll need the power to travel through space. Pick my nose. Sorry. Was it she? I swear. Switchy, I swear. This little blob of gooey goo, Luma, can give you this power. I will entrust you with his care. Skadoodle badoodle. It becomes Shashoodle. Oh, my beastly power! You have the ability to spin now. Shake your penis. Disaster has struck us just as has visited you. With Luma, I hope you can rescue the grand stars. May the stars shout down and shout down and yeah, I can't speak right now. Uh...
All right, what do you got to say to me? Mew Mew! Shake the Wii Remote to penis to move into things that could look break. You can even spin and he's just done the... Goodbye! All right. What do you got to say to me? Hi there! Good to see you. I have some bad news though, I see I had a launch star all ready for you, but Meteor smashed it up. You can't leave without us to find all the star chips to fix it. Oh, and be sure not to fall into the black hole. Black hole churn. Oh, that went to the black hole. Wash away your ring, black hole churn. I'm share won't you girl over. Here if I can turn back time. Why do I damn it just keep jumping in there? Alright, oh yeah, and I have to avoid those guys. Woohoo! Now I want this. Oh gosh. I earned a one-up! Oh crap, I almost got hit by that meteor. Oh, I almost got hit by that meteor. Do 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 I can just jump on their head too. No need to spin them. Alright. And I'll do this to you. I'll do this to you. I think that's all of them. Alright. Mew! Thanks, would you mind risking my buddy in that base up there too? I'll transform into a sling. Uh, transform! Mario, roll out! Yahoo! Oh shit. I get the coin. Oh, I guess that. Yeah, you take damage, grab a point, boost your life. Thanks. Take that. Good job. Da da da. Get that star. Oh crap. Oh crap. It's so hard to judge with this 3D look um, when I'm jumping on someone's head. Like that. Oh gosh. I don't want to get near those electrocution things. Like that. Like that. Oh crap. Alright, I think I'm gonna go inside now because oh crap, I almost I keep almost electrocuting myself. Uh, okay, what do you guys say? Hurry! Down here. You're not gonna rape me, are you? Oh hell, please stop. We've been waiting for you. Who's we? Oh. That's a grand star. We have to save it. Yeah. They're using the Grand Star to power that awful machine. It looks like it's making something. Something. We have to do something before the Grand Star power is drained. Quick, find a way to stop the terrible machine! Dun dun dun. Alright. So, like I said... Oh, crap. Oh! I don't even have to get in the middle of the thing. So, like I said, I've kind of already played this bit because my Elgato... Oh, no! My Elgato decided not to record that other video. So I'll just do that. So 
I know where everything's located. Ooh. So if I walk on them twice, they reactivate. Got it. the flip switch is on the floor shut the I get it, yes. Give me the candy! Doo -doo. Oh, I can't leave that Goomba alive. I can't have no witnesses. Oh, the magnets are gone! Okay, I can see what I missed. Kishaw! Oh, yes. I think I had everything there. Whoa. Ultra trippy. Alright, I guess I get you. Yeah! Me. And I get the star! You got the grand star! Ooh, number one! Me lucky bouncy. Ah, oh, better than Wally. Remember the scene in Wally when they're flying through space? Yeah. And I'm gonna float here. And I feed the black hole. That thing looks very ominous. If I were someone else, if I haven't like someone played this game already. I would have thought, oh no, she's a villain and she's gonna blow everything up because we're feeding the star. But this is a Mario game, so I guess we don't do that. Okay, what do you gotta say to me? You got the star! Grand Star Rescue! Score updated. You increase your star bit count. You discover a new galaxy. Ooh! Terrace. At first, when I played this, I thought it said Taraco, but it's Terrace. That E's weird. The beacon is lit again. It shines weakly, maybe only as bright as a classic star, but at least the poor Lumas will survive now. Oh, thank you for saving the Grand Star. These star people are my family. They mean so much to me. <laughs> Welcome to the Common Observatory. It's my home, and also home to the Lumas. You see, we travel the starry skies. We pass by this area once every hundred years, but we suddenly stop in front of this planet. A strange force had lashed on our ship, pulling away star bits and our power source. Power stars. Our ship had lost power, so it entered a deep hibernation state in which it could not move. I am getting so lightheaded doing this voice. <laughs> Those who took a special run picked up the power stars and discovered the power to cross the universe. Please. Please, I have a request. I request, I request you. This observatory uses star power to project images of the galaxies that are scared of us in space. Like, and there's a chance we can use our few remaining stars to look for other power stars. These round rooms are called domes, and we observe galaxies from domes such as these. But the only ones that is working right now, powered by the power star you restored, is the one, the terrace. Please go to the terrace and try to recover the star, power stars from the galaxy you can see from there. If we do that, we'll be able to restore the Comet Observatory's ability to fly like a starship. Then perhaps we can pursue the thieves who ran off with the power stars. Okay. That sounds great. And save game. Woohoo! Alright, what else you gotta say? Oh, can I bonk you? Oh, I just move your skirt. You should go to the terrace first. Please rescue the power stars and the galaxies you see there. Alright. Uh, we gotta save me. This is the Comet Observatory! Oh. Get a big overview of everything there. <gasps> oh crap. <laughs> I almost fell off. Pretty sure it'll just throw you back on, but I don't wanna. I don't wanna test that. Uh, Alright, this is the 
garage. Hello! This is the garage, yes. I'll take that now. Thank you very much. Let's see, read. Garage, your one stop shopper in Tickle Starship repairs. We don't have a starship yet. Nope, I can't break the sign. We got butterflies! Hee <laughs> hee! Alright. What do you guys say? You can't go up there yet. I'm fine. I wonder if I can ride that thing. Probably can, but I don't want to risk it right now. So yeah! Um, that is, so far, Super Mario Galaxy. Fun game. Uh, it was very unique when it came out. It still is unique. But it gets... It'd be a little bit of a headache, like, traversing these circular worlds um, with the different camera angles and trying to point the Wii Remote to get those stars. Woohoo! To get those star bits. It gets a little tedious um, doing that. And if you get involved with trying to get all the stars, like my friend, then you can just waste hours, which I don't think really gives you... This is, and this is pre, like, trophy days. Obviously, there's no trophies on the Wii, um, the Wii U, the Switch. So you get, like, a hooray, you did it for unlocking that. So, yeah, um, I think we'll continue this. I want to do multiple different games for Mario Mondays, but I definitely want to continue with this and actually see how it ends. So I don't know how long that's going to take, but I'm in for the ride. If you guys like it, I hope you do. Uh, go ahead and hit the like button. If you don't like it, it makes me sad, but go ahead and show your dislike with the dislike button. Uh, subscribe if you aren't already. Hit the bell icon to get notified Woo! when we do make more videos or when new video releases. And yeah, thanks for watching. And tune in next time. Oh my god, my legs. My legs. What do you do in the evening when you don't know what to do? Read a book, play a game.